Well, we're here at the assisted pull-up machine. Another one of my favorites. <laughs> Let's get to it. All right, I like the overhand grip, the wide grip. That's my favorite, it's the most difficult, the most challenging. You wanna make sure that you start with a full extension. Put yourself all the way up until the plates touch and back down, again to a full extension. What's great about pull-ups is when you become familiar enough with your muscles and which ones to engage in order to do a good one, you can really make this a very effective exercise. And this helps build that nice V in your back, which gives the illusion of having a smaller waist. There you go. Again, I always try and do sets of 15. I usually superset these with some assisted dips. Ah, love the supersets. Me too, usually like a 30 second to a minute break. And then again, make sure you're trying to get a full extension on these. I will warn women in doing these exercises if you have implants, be very careful not to overdo it. A lot can go wrong. If you lean into this, you're gonna get a little bit more peck, but if you keep your body upright, you get a lot of tricep work in. So funny story, I was at an event one time and the Marines were there trying to recruit potential Marines and they had a pull-up bar and just strangers were walking up to the bar and trying to do pull-ups. And at this event, I was in a cute little mini skirt, six inch heels, cute top, and I was walking past and all of the 19 to 25 year old boys and men were doing them wrong and they looked ugly and they were doing underhand <laughs> and they were doing wrong. So I said, can I try? And I did with my heels on and everything. I went up, wide grip, overhand grip, dead stop, and I pulled 11 clean ones and everybody was like, are you kidding me right In now? your mini skirt. Oh, <laughs> In a mini skirt I love it. and my six inch heels. <laughs> I love it. Uh